with the massive amounts of advantages and innovation that the rise of new technology had provided us, it has also attracted new challenges and issues that society must face. Amongst them include cyberbullying, gadget slash computer addiction, and digital divide. So, what are these three issues all about? First, cyberbullying is bullying that takes place over digital devices like cell phones, computers, and tablets. It includes sending, posting, or sharing negative or harmful content about someone else. Some cyberbullying even crosses the line into unlawful or criminal behavior. It is a significant stressor in a young person's life. According to statistics, 45% of young and older teens have been victims of cyberbullies. It's an alarming percentage that seems to be only increasing as time goes on. Next, gadget or computer addiction is defined as any obsessive behavior with gadgets or computers which interferes with usual living and causes rigorous stress on family, friends, loved ones, and one's work performance. This type of addiction is significantly related with psychological symptoms such as depression, anxiety, social isolation, and disturbed sleep pattern. Based on studies, the average smartphone user touches their device 2,617 times a day. Finally, digital divide. It is the economic, educational, and social inequalities between those who have computers and online access and those who do not. This provides various disadvantages such as 1. It is an expensive affair. 2. It widens the segregation between the people. And 3. It has a huge negative impact on the economy. The digital divide is a worldwide issue and about 70% of the global population fall on the downside of it, a situation referred to as digital abyss. So, now that we know all of this, how? How can we prevent it, alleviate it, how can we solve it? The answer lies in this one simple statement. Technology should always be used for the betterment of society. In cyberbullying, spreading awareness, teaching how to respect others, and how to use proper digital etiquettes can help prevent the rise of this issue. With gadget or computer addiction, you can explore more hobbies outside the digital world, such as various physical activities. Finally, with Digital Divide, we can follow these four simple principles. Economic equality, social mobility, economic growth, and democratic organization. In the end, we should always keep in mind that in this world, technology is at the top. It provides great power, and whoever yields that power is always responsible for it.